Hi friends, welcome to my channel and this is Citrix Certification Video Training and this is the 15th video in this series and in this video we are going to uh, check how to create delivery groups in Citrix Studio. So you can see in last few videos we have created mastered image, we have uh, installed like um, VDA agent on our server uh, server machine, we have created the machine catalog and now let's deploy the machine catalog by using the delivery groups. So here is my infrastructure which we are going to use in this demo so we have first machine is win2k12 dc01 which is my active directory domain controller here you can see and this is my active directory domain controller i have installed active directory dhcp and dns role on my, this machine you can also verify here my domain name which is victorinfosol.com and machine name is win2k12 dc01 which is basically the uh, um, basically domain controller and my second machine is Citrix DC01 which is basically Citrix uh, server delivery controller so here you can see if you go to server manager local server you can verify the Citrix DC01 so here you can see I have installed uh, like all the Citrix or Zen desktop deployment um, uh, core component like Citrix Studio Storefront, Delivery Controller, License Administrator, License Manager, everything is installed here. Also, I have installed a Citrix Zen Center here to take the control of the Zen servers. And last, we have a Citrix Zen Server, which is Zen Server 01, which is providing hypervisor here to run the virtual machines. So, you can see I have logged in to my Zen Center. Uh, Zen Server 01 by using the uh, Zen Center. So we have our master image running here, which we have created one or two video ago. And this is the basically uh, catalog machine which we have created in last video. So in this video, we have to create a delivery groups here. So let's you can see I have logged into Citrix Studio and my I'm connected with my Noida Citrix uh, site you can see on a common task you can see we have site configuration task which we have performed here everything is given there and machine catalog you can see we have created in last video when you get 12 r to master image which have one machine so if you want to create a delivery group so next task is go ahead and create a new delivery group also we can go here on delivery group right click and create a new delivery group so both is the same way so I'm going to click here and let's create a new delivery group and you can see here create delivery group wizard is open and now getting started with delivery groups so delivery group okay, you can see the definition here delivery group are basically co uh, collection of the desktop application or server that you can create for different different uh, type of uh, common department of users so you can say we can create a um, some delivery group for our call center users our call or our uh, telecaller department or any any other department so let's go ahead and uh, create so make sure you have enough virtual machine available in desktop OS or server OS machine catalog to create a delivery group so yes we have our uh, server server OS machine catalog created which is in last video win to get 12 r to uh, master image so let's go ahead and click next and now you can see we have create uh, we have our uh, machine catalog here you can see the select machine if you have more than one uh, machine catalog it will be uh, you can see all the catalog here available catalog so we have only one catalog here you can see the type and machine we have one machine so to choose the number of machine for this uh, delivery group so might be you you can add uh, more than um, one so in my you can see the machine number is set one to so I'm going to set the uh, machine one here and a uh, delivery group so click next and now we have a uh, so here uh, users and delegation so allow anyone any any authenticated user uh, to use this uh, this delivery group or you can you can limit the users or group here you can see users or group both so if you want i can go here and search the user you can see the all three users I'm going to add here 
also if you have any group created here you can see you can add the group here so let's do one thing let's create one group here uh, call it like here you can see group and make it citrix users and I'm going to add the, all the users here so call it users um, so I'll close it so go to properties and members and if you type user click next all the three users I'm going to use add here so this is a small way to create a group and you can add that group also here so I'm going to call Citrix and just check name and we have a group name here so you can see the group and users is selected here so now you can go ahead and also you can give the unauthenticated anonymous user no credential is required to access the storefront so storefront will create in next video so let's give the permission to these user only so click next and we have application here which we can give the access so if you go next you can uh, add the desktop here here you can add the desktop here so in my in in here I'm going to add the application as well as so if you go here and click the like you can s click anyone so if I click existing and you can see no application is found and if I go and from start menu if I click so now you can see it's searching for the machine and it's uh, powering on basically machine so waiting for machine to start so if you go here you can see the machine is not started yet and now you can see the machine is starting up you can see here so so it, it will start the machine it will register the machine which domain you can see here for now if you go to Citrix 01 you can see the operating system detail is not there so it will start the machine it will join this machine in domain and then it will, it will uh, like um, get the all the application which is running there so you can see now it's waiting for the machine to register so just wait for a few more minutes to get the machine is registered with active directory then it will give you all the application list which is available here on the on server which is uh, Citrix 01 so let's wait for a few, few minutes so so machine is still waiting for registration so let's verify here if I click refresh button and go to properties so here you can see the machine is now registered here the operating system windows server 2012 r2 data center and version is given here so looks everything fine so it will take few more minutes and now you can see it's a uh, added application and we have total 60 application here it will take some time to give you all the details so we have now list of levels so you can set the application which you want to publish so let's use the few of them to launch here so like notepad plus plus you can launch you can launch the outlook excel these these softwares so looks everything good now so click ok now we have publishing 11 application which is running on our machine Citrix 01 by using this delivery group so click next and now we have a um, that like desktop assignation if you want you can assign the desktop here also so allow everyone with access this delivery group to use a desktop so you can create here like Win2K12 R2 server call it server and enable desktop so it will be enable like uh, available at the uh, delivery group so click OK and now we have we can go and here you can see all delivery group users can access uh, desktop delivery group users we have basically these users 
so go ahead and now we are done with it and you can type the delivery group name here so call it windows 2k12 r2 dg and delivery group and you can call it like click on finish so it will now you can see the delivery groups is being created so creating applications almost done so now we have a machine catalog we have a delivery group both is available and if you go to delivery groups now you are able to see here the delivery groups so here you can see the win 2k12 r2dz and if I go here you can see the name and every details in application which application is launched here so you can see the applications and if you want to add add application add machine everything is there and desktop you can see which desktop is going machine catalog which is associated with and users you can see tags application group we don't have and administrator so we, which have full access so this is all about creating the delivery group in Citrix Studio 7.11 so Thank you for watching and please subscribe me for more videos and if you have any query, any question related to this, please post me on my giveaway mail IDs. Thank you once again. Bye-bye.